Alright guys, welcome to the channel. Hope you're all doing good. Late night video before bed. Or before a shower and bed. Um Yeah Yeah, um Shall I have a shower tonight? I feel tired. <laughs> I'm already tired. Maybe I'll have a shower tomorrow. Maybe I will. Um Or I might have one tonight, I don't know. Don't think I'll be going to church tomorrow, so I feel a bit too tired. Um, <sighs> been listening to a lot of music tonight. I think that's worn me out a bit. Probably, it's, well, I say it worn me out a bit. I think I listened to it for a bit too long, and I think it started wearing me out. Um, I know music usually gives you energy, but but yeah. Um, I've been singing as well. I think the singing's kind of like uh, singing's probably tired me out more than listening to the music has. But um, feel a bit tired anyway. So, um, but yeah, guys, um, I just want to say um, for a while I kind of isolated myself from, I guess, from the world and from. Uh, I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing because like what someone told me, you get a lot of snakes in this world, do you know what I mean, the people you can't trust, so um, so I think it's a good thing that I've isolated myself in a way, I'm free to do what I want and I've got my freedom, so, so I think that's a good thing, but I think being a Christian, sometimes we can kind of isolate ourselves too much, we can, uh, you got to understand like we are... Uh, we're not of the world, but we're in the world still, so you can't help but kind of like pay attention to what goes on in the world, and that's quite normal, really. Do you know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with that, really. Um, as long as you don't get too carried away by it all, or or yeah, um, be led astray by it all. Like, um, but yeah, like just. Just paying attention to what's going on in the world. There's nothing really wrong with that, do you know what I mean? But as Christians, sometimes we can kind of see the world as the enemy and everything to do with the world as bad and... Do you know what I mean? And I think you can get a bit carried away with it sometimes when you're a Christian kind of thing. Because um, you hear stuff off other Christians and you see stuff in in the media and stuff or saying like everything's Satan, do you know what I mean? And uh I think uh as much as Satan does influence a lot of things I believe, um you can't hide away from everything that happens in the world and that Even if it is to do with Satan, do you know what I mean? It's one of them. Uh, we're still in the world at the end of the day, so we got to pay somewhat of attention to it, do you know what I mean? We can't like, isolate ourselves from the world because we're still in it, do you know what I mean? Even though we're not of it, we're still in it. So this is what I think personally. I don't think it's healthy to completely isolate yourself from the world. I I'd say don't be a friend of the world would say that, do you know what I mean, don't follow the world's ways, um, but there's nothing wrong with paying attention to what goes on in the world, do you know what I mean, as long as you don't follow the ways of the world, um, do you know what I mean, it's okay, it's okay to listen to a bit of secular music, especially when it's stuff you listen to when you were younger, do you know what I mean, um, like for nostalgia purposes, do you know what I mean? As long as you don't take it too serious and you don't uh, buy into it, do you know what I mean? Or, or start letting it change the way you think, do you know what I mean? Um, when, you, when you know the word of God, it doesn't have that effect nine times out of ten. Admittedly, the flesh can. If you see a load of naked, with semi-naked women gyrating, can cause you to make you want to get want to sin do you know what I mean it can like um cause that sometimes admittedly 
Well, um, well, yeah, at the same time, we're all only human, do you know what I mean? But yeah, you should you just need to be careful that you don't that you don't lead you into sin, basically. But yeah, like um, likes to be enjoyed at the same time. You don't want to live. You don't want to become a total like. <laughs> you don't want to be obsessed like by um by living. T you want to live holy. Don't get me wrong. You do, but you want to somewhat. You don't want to what you don't want to be too stressed or worried that you're not living holy enough. Do you know what I mean? At the end of the day, you you want to live holy, but you want to enjoy life as well. Do you know what I mean? Um, I don't mean go out partying. I don't mean that to enjoy life. I don't mean follow the world's ways. But it's okay to have a laugh and a joke with people. It's okay to listen to the odd bit of music from your youth to. Uh, Watch a film, do you know what I mean? All this stuff's okay, do you know what I mean? As long as as long as you're wise to what the devil devil's up to, do you know what I mean? And that you can read between the lines, do you know what I mean? That's all I can say really. Um and see the error of people's ways, so you don't go down those ways yourself. That's all I can say. Um but when you know the word of God, you can do that because you know the truth and you know what God says. So you can do that when you know the word of God. It's when you don't know the word of God, that's when you can get carried away by the things of the world and what the devil offers and sin and all that sort of stuff. Like you can get carried away with it then. Um, if you don't know the word of God and the truth, but if you know the word of God and the truth, then, you know what I mean, we're in the world, we're not of it, but we're in it, so, so you can, you can pay attention to what's going on in the world, you can have a laugh and a joke, you can, do you know what I mean, you can listen to music from your youth, you can occasionally, if you feel like it, um, as long as you don't take it serious, um, you can watch films, do you know what I mean, as long as they're not too negative or too violent or whatever, do you know what I mean, to, to anything, too many, too, ex, too extremes of anything, do you know what I mean, as, as long as they're not too extreme of anything, then you can watch them, do you know what I mean, um, as long as they don't go to extremes in, any, in anything like violence, sexual or, um, horror, do you know what I mean, as long as they're not too, too extreme then you can really watch them do you know what I mean you know what ones make you feel good and what don't and if they don't make you feel good don't watch them do you know what I mean it's one of them um if it has a negative effect on you don't watch it um so yeah um same as if songs have a negative effect on you don't listen to them do you know what I mean it's one of them um we're very much in control of what we're taking and don't take in, so do you know what I mean? Um Well yeah, like I say, I kinda isolated myself from the world from a bit for a bit. I think I've done it a bit too much and it affected me and then the devil started like um attacking my mind and it's hard to explain, but I know what I'm talking about, but um, it's hard to explain, but yeah, um, the devil's been playing off my anxiety a lot um, to do with my mental illness from being isolated for so long uh, from the world and stuff and life. Um, it's been playing off my anxiety and trying to trigger me and trying to upset me and make me even more anxious kind of thing that's what he's been trying to do but um i'm wise to it now do you know what i mean um like i say i've realized isolating yourself from the world it's good to a point but you can't do it completely because we're still in the world do you know what i mean and it's not healthy to completely do you know what i mean despite what some christians might tell you or what they think um it's not completely healthy to isolate yourself completely from the world because you're still in the world, do you know what I mean? Even though you're not of it, so 
this is what I've come to learn guys for a while I was like just I was too I was too holy like do you know what I mean too much um I was trying to be too holy and it's just not um it's good to be holy like don't get me wrong but you've gotta you gotta live your life as well do you know what I mean you can't be like a monk do you know what I mean um in my eyes at least um you can you can in terms of going out partying and drinking you don't have to do that no one says you have to do that but um but yeah you can't be too you can't be too like out of the world you know what i mean because we're still in it that's what i'm saying and i kind of was like that for a while and i think i think my mental health suffered because of that um i think it not just that because of my illness as well in the past i kind of got isolated from people and stuff and uh god really had to kind of strip everything away from me and make me kind of like it's gonna sound funny but make me rely on him completely like um almost like almost not a child but almost like a child do you know what i mean my like, would rely on the parents, he made me rely on him that much kind of thing because he knew if he didn't make that happen like that, I wouldn't follow him, do you know what I mean? I'd go my own way kind of thing. I'd do what I wanted to do. Um, so he knew that was the only way to get me to follow him um, and, and believe in him because of my past experiences and stuff and what I've been through. Um, as I've mentioned on this site before, um, but on this YouTube before even, but yeah, um, I think that's all I want to say, really, guys. Um, I think I've covered everything I want to say. Yeah, that's all I want to say. So yeah, just a quick video. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. As always, I appreciate you all. Um, love you all and keeping you all in my prayers and uh. As I always say, wishing you the best. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, I shall be back with some more content soon. I'm sure I'll be able to think of a video or two to do. Might do some tomorrow, maybe. Um, sure, I'll be able to think of something if I put my thinking cap on. So, so yeah. Uh, God give me this revelation, so I thought I'd share it. I'd share it with you guys. Um, but it's more my revelation than other people's revelation. Other people wouldn't have this revelation, <laughs> do you know what I mean? But I've kind of had it because it applies to me. Um, may apply to some other Christians out there as well. So hopefully it gets to the right people. God will do His work, and He will do, I'm sure. So yeah. But anyway, guys, that's all I want to say for now. Thanks for watching, take care, God bless, much love, I'll be back soon, take care guys, bye, love you all guys, thank you, bye.